Welcome to the K1 World Grand Prix 2014 Japan. This is the Under 65 Program World Championship Tournament at the European National Stadium. I'm Russell Goodall. And I'm Nicholas Pitts. Nick, this is the quarter final of the uh, first uh, K1 six, Under 65 KG Tournament mm. uh, back in 2014. Shigeaki Yamazaki from a crush and uh, Keio Wira Sakurek at this time. He had been in Japan fighting and never uh, lost against a Japanese fighter and here he is in his first K1 fight. Mm. This is going to be an interesting fight to watch because Yamazaki is actually a fantastic fighter but mm -hmm. we're up against the Mutai champion. No. <laughs> Whoopsie did. And yep. this kind of changes the game. And yeah. it's also very handsome. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> 0.5 seconds in, yeah. this kick by KO. Like, no missing around here. Oh, it kind of yeah. just sets the standard of what you're up against. Now he's already felt the kicking power of you, and this is why he's probably you now. <laughs> a little hello there at the beginning. Oh, yeah. 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 Wow. Even with his hand up, that kick would have hurt. <laughs> he's not just fighting the Mutai fan, he's fighting the Mutai champion who's South Park. Oh, he walked right into that. Man, that cr I keep to cut him on that. That was a perfect timing for that lift. Yeah, he cut him on the forehead with that too. <laughs> I do not know how he's still standing after that hit. It's just a different kicking power. It went a bit too fat. It's just incredible. That's <laughs> 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 very long time. Yeah, uh, <laughs> at the stage. At the stage, the way. 129 wins. Only 41 by knockout, actually. That <laughs> sounds a little bit unbelievable. He has had 30 defeats. Oh, I can't look at that kick. He's literally just going to try kicking him in the head. That's it. That's his, that's his point. Will and how will. Oh, oh stop it. Nice little no, it's just not <laughs> jacking like this now, he's absolutely important. Yeah. Well, that's a good question. Didn't hurt him though. Look how comfortable he feels in there. And then if he does something, he does it. He's just like, oh, he's just like, oh, he's just Man, his forehead is swollen from that kick. Yeah. Oh. Oh. And that was the bell. It is uh, the, the, the uh, holding up of the fighter at the end of the round. <laughs> yeah, but Gail knows he's won the first round. For sure, but he did well, like right at the end. They're working on the quarter doubles. Oh, they need to ice that face down. Is that up there? No. This was this one. one. Yeah. Oh. Look, look at that. Boom. Oh. It was incredible that he went left high kick and straight away as he's putting his foot down, he did a left hook. Yeah, the last thing is super exciting. This is busy as we walk into round. You know, it's in two. those kind of last 10 seconds yeah. of the fight that, you know, things can like really turn the other way around. Go, go, ready. You never know. Hey, why? Look, there are two more rounds. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I got to remind myself that because I was thinking, okay. We have a round two coming up. Uh, Yamazaki vs. Yeah. KO.
Look how nervous he is. <laughs> is that what it is? Yeah, <laughs> for sure. Yeah. He's also got an injury on his right foot that we haven't even spoken about. He's probably got like a really bad like, like pinky or something. Is that from like uh, one of the, the kicks? No, 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 this is from before the fight. Uh, so he's walking into the corner with an injury foot. Uh, go, we've got the band-aids in here. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, okay. Uh, not to mention that. Uh, so, mm. And that does make the cycle a little bit is the risk of fighting. Right? Oh man, what an exchange. Hey, 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 hey. Wow. Hey. Oh, wow. You know, he almost had him. Yeah, like, yeah. He almost had him. I kind of give it to him. He's a fantastic boxer when he, he lets his hand go. I don't know if it's like the subrollers to the eagerness of the team. It's the beginning of the team. Yeah, it's the beginning of the team. It's the beginning of the team. It's the beginning of the team. He's got this funny, lengthy kind of uh, um, uh, rhythm to him. Right, right. Like, yeah, like, yeah. Yeah. It almost looks like he's out of balance half of the time. But uh, he seems to be doing just right. Mm. Controlling this fight, I almost had him, and then he's like, he didn't overexert himself, he didn't punch yeah, himself yeah. out, but he almost got him. This is it at the end. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It could have been, maybe. Could have been. Uh, could have been. Could've but, yeah. But that's as far as he went with that, and then they get breaking up here. Because he knows he wants to maybe stay, save his energy. For and then him. he slowed down. Yeah. <laughs> right, right. Because he knows he wants to win and go for the next fight. We'll see. Yeah, it's a fine line. These, these, you know, punch outs because. I mean, if you don't get your opponent and, and you punch yourself out and you right. get too tired, then you can't, you know, protect yourself properly after yeah. that. Yeah. And that leaves a gap, right? Yeah. So then again, that's a, it's a dangerous strategy to follow, but it does work sometimes. Okay. Let's we'll see if weathering the storm. Yeah. yeah. Is that what it is? Yeah. Three. We'll see what that tool oh. does and how Yamazaki does in round three. The one is not going to start off with pretty pressure. Mm. Again. 
You gotta think to yourself that it looks like you know when Bluff Hall first came on the scene against the Masato in those days. Yeah. And it was just like, what is going on here? He's kind of got that aura about him. Heo has, right? Yeah. yeah. It's just old habits, bro. Right? Maybe she can't take the Muay Thai fighter out of the Muay Thai fighter. There we go. Oh, man, that just pissed him off. Wow, I didn't <laughs> like that. Did not like that at all, bro. You see how crazy like this? Slowly putting the pressure in there, like waiting for that, like, the, the, the right distance yeah, behind yeah, him yeah. before he unleashes his you can see how he's really calculating what he's doing. It was like, that was a fantastic move. He almost got lucky there. Because that kid had yeah, yeah. been a game changer. I've always seen another one. We. Good. Oh man, dear, that is so sweet to that kick. Mm. Oh! Ready? Ready? Mm -hmm. yeah. 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 That timing for when Gil gets that left high kick up there is incredible. It's like really the, the only thing that's saving Ron Zanke is that he's got his left his right hand up there. Oh. At least mm. he's trying with everything. I've got to give it to him. He's a fantastic fighter. Mm -hmm. Oh, Three, uh, almost, yeah. Well, that is that, uh, three rounds. It's good final. Mm. Now that's the end. Yep, we know who won this one. <laughs> oh, well. I'm not sure about the scorecard, but I would probably say 30 28 mm -hmm. to Gale. Yeah. Maybe even 30 27. But he did a fantastic flying knee. Yeah. Oh yeah. No, he had a great see. punch out. There was a great somewhere. couple of punch outs actually. Yeah. It's just maybe the fact that he was a southpaw. If he had been, you know, maybe orthodox, it could have, it could have changed. I don't know. It's always hard to fight yeah, someone who's not fighting. Oh, judges and then uh, all of this uh, match. Oh, the K165 KG will turn into points. There's the winner, Hale will win. There's going to be a interesting to watch his career. Yeah, and in the K1. Yeah, including the games, the fights we'll be having today later on. Yeah, and the fights we'll be having today later on. Yeah, and the fights we'll be having today later on. We might see some of that one more. I'm going to play back. Oh, oh yeah! yeah. That's that that kick! Oh man! That oh, That is... It is almost a timing that you can't teach, but apparently you can because yeah. you must have learned it somehow. Well, <laughs> thank you all for watching. Uh, we'll see more of uh, KO in the next uh, upcoming fight. So this is the K1 World Grand Prix 2014 Japan under 65 KG World Championship Tournament. I'm Russell Little. And Nicholas Pettis.